Hello from Slovenia again. Uh, I was playing before, so I have my working space messy. Uh, this is just my normal mixture, white mixture, as I use for my flower dips. Uh, if you didn't see my video about mixing my pouring medium, you can check my video number uh, 208, I think. Uh, and I will do another bloom blooming technique video but with just with my pouring medium and a touch of this polyurethane satin varnish in my paints not in my base coat just in my paints because I you know that uh, the secret of Shelley art technique is out already you can check uh, some other artists that they do this I will use just whoops and I just did a mess here uh, with my recipe uh, these things um, that uh, use the uh, most uh, artists that will take his, his her course uses I can't get it so I I will give it a try just with my pouring medium and a little of this satin varnish as I already used with my blooms so the first uh, color was um, Perlex pigment mixed with this um, pouring medium and then iridescent uh, bronze and dioxazine in purple and this is gr greenish blue and of course white white is uh, thinner uh, white don't have uh, doesn't have Mm, this uh, polyurethane in it is just my pouring medium and titanium white so let's blow this It's just a little bloom. You see this uh, cells already forming and um, I hope that I will get more of this uh, colors out while I'm stretching. I just want to show you the consistency of my other paints. I hope that you can see. The consistency is uh, pretty much the same as for my flower dips. So that's try to stretch this and see what will what we will get 
I will not stretch this over the corners yet, so just go like this. This corner. Now I will go back and then I will see if I want to stretch I hope that I wasn't out of the frame because stretch this or maybe I did already back to the middle Maybe a little to this side. Because I want to bring some of this paints out that they are underneath. Some of this iridescent maybe. Just try to stretch a little more here. And back because uh, this lovely cell is popping through while I'm stretching it and I really, really love them. I will show it to you on the close-up. I know that you can't see it now, but you will see that they are really, really, really nice. this white and this white spot like it is because I just want to see if something will pop out here if I or I will get just tiny white dots no I will not torch it Colors are gorgeous together. I think that I will 
use them again together because they are just beautiful so here I just blow a little too much so but now it is what it is I will take you down to see what I'm talking about because I think that you didn't see this from up high so focus you see this lovely lovely colorful cells they are almost like stones or something just love this here with the white and I will show you which is my favorite this part here I have to say that this is my favorite part I hope that this will dry okay I think that it will because I didn't have problems with my pouring medium so you see this part here is just gorgeous and this one here too these colors are really really nice together and this part here I love the painting I must say because it has so much of these beautiful details and I kind of like the whole painting too not completely completely satisfied but <laughs> most of my expectations are fulfilled I don't know what is the right word this iridescent bronze will dry shiny and um, pearl pigment blue pearl pigment too so pearl X pigment so I think that this one will dry really really nice so this is it for today <laughs> give it a try Maybe your pouring medium will work too. So this is it for today and see you on the next one. Bye.